How do you know if your star has been stolen? How do you know if your destiny has been stolen or covered or somebody else is using it? Now, this video I'm going to explain to you so that you can understand what happens in the life of a person when his star is stolen or when his star is covered. Now, your star is your destiny. Uh, every, every, every person born of a woman come into this world with potential, with blessings which God has had packaged not for his or our life from the day he was born till he dies. So those blessings which you came in into this world, sometimes they can be stolen by the enemy. The Bible says the enemy came to kill, steal, and to destroy. Sometimes they can be covered. And if, you are, if your star is stolen, if your star is covered or somebody else is using it, you know, your destiny, you, you will not be able to maximize your destiny. You will not be able to become the person whom God has intended you to be. So this is why this video, you have to watch it till the end so that you can, you can know, you can tell whether your star has been stolen or exchanged or covered. This video is for you. Hello guys, thanks for watching. I'm Cleo Faswanyama, Cleo with him. And this is Christian Media, where we bring you news, commentaries, Bible-based teachings, gospel music, plus many more. And if you want to donate to this ministry to support us financially, use the information on the screen. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Now, how do you tell now? If your star is stolen, how do you know that your destiny is stolen? Now, what I would like you to note is that um, stolen destinies uh, occurs mostly in little children and babies. Little children, understand? Little children from the age, it can be also, it can be just from the age of uh, even five and below. But little children, you know, most of the destiny which are being stolen through witchcraft are the destinies of little children. It is difficult in the realm of the spirit to steal destiny of a grown man or somebody who has grown, you know, of a grown person. So what they do, they can only cover it, but they may not steal it. Now, destinies which are stolen are destinies of children. This is why you ought to be careful with children. Especially parents, you who are giving birth, you are raising kids, you ought to be careful. Some of you, you are dead. the destinies of your children can be stolen. You may not know that you have given birth to a king. You may not know you have given birth to a president. You have given birth to a leader, to the future president of a nation. And witches and wizards, they can tell if your child is going to be a leader. Because they could see the star of Jesus. They said that where is he born? The king of the Jews. We have seen his star in the east. And we have come to worship him. By looking at the star of Jesus, they could know who Jesus was. So people can, can look at your star from the realm of the spirit. And they can know who you are. And if you're not strong enough, they can, you know, if you're not... If, if you're not uh, well uh, you know, enlightened in, in, the, in the things of God, they can steal it. Now, to know if your star has stolen is about, there is no sense of destiny. Now, when you, when you have a child who is growing up, does not show interest in any talent, does not show interest in any kind of ability, you need to be very careful. Especially when children, they come, you know, uh, into the age of teenage. Once they become teenagers, you know, they begin to explore many things. And some of the things which they explore is their potentials. I remember my mom tells me that when I was a young boy, just like uh, three to four years old, and, the, the, you know, they, they would have home cell meetings at our home. Back then, they would have home cell meetings. And... Um, the, the person, the pastor in charge of the home cell would sing, eh? they, would, they would sing a song in Swahili called Inginya, 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 Wemoja Wakondo. So my mom told me that after the home cell was uh, over and, and everybody went home, I would imitate and mimic what the pastor was saying. I would be, I would be like this, Inginya, Inginya. So people said, hey, this young man, is going to be a minister of the gospel. You see, that star can be seen when you are young. So, there are so many 
this is where i find even even in hollywood there are young kids who are doing movies they are doing comedies they are doing dancing and they're doing so well because they are their star is beginning to show so your potential can begin to show when you are young you don't need to be old for you to know what god has called you to do so if you find somebody and you have no sense of destiny at all you don't know what to do it's like you are confused you are just there just know that your star has been stolen i know somebody i'll 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 not i'll not want to mention because of uh confidentiality i know somebody who you know i grew up together with and uh we went to school together and um in fact at some point i used to copy him when i was in primary one two three i used to copy him he, he used to show me how to do my homework i don't know what happened along the way that guy became a dummy you know he began he could not you know he became i'm sorry to say that like uh, uh you know he became slow in class the 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 boy who was bright started to, uh, started to be you know um the last one in class he he was performing so badly to the point that when we had finished our primary level the, his father had to you know to make him repeat because he was almost the last in the class and that boy was so bright i remember he was always to teach me homework something happened to his star somewhere if you have a child who well, you know they have been doing well and then suddenly you know they begin to drop they don't perform well in class be careful something spiritual has happened to that child they have taken his star and they take the star and sell it to somebody else very be, be very careful so that's why this is why you find many youths we need to find them you know the neighborhood they are just chilling around taking taking drugs taking alcohol they have nothing to do they're just wasting their lives most of them their destinies were stolen when they were young and so you find they have no interest in anything they're not interested in anything they don't want to do anything they just want to be there they just want to relax they don't want to bother themselves they don't want you know to to put extra effort you know to better their lives they don't want to do anything their stars have been was stolen this is a sign of a star which i understand it number two how to know if your star was covered now if you not know your star is covered now when somebody's star is covered is whereby if you find somebody was doing good you are doing so good you are doing good in business you know we are you know at work in uh, career wise we're doing so well and then eventually you know things just start to dwindle down you begin to lose everything you lose your house you lose your car you lose your business the banks have come to you know to you know to the you owe the bank money the debtors have come the creditors have come you know everything's a mess such things happen when your star is covered and this is a result of jealousy you are doing well and people are not happy with your progress so they go to a witch doctor and because you are an adult because you are a, a grown man they may not be able to steal your star as i've said that stars most most stars which are stolen are stars of little children babies and little children so because they cannot be able to steal your star they cover it they cover your glory so you are doing well eventually you stop doing well eventually things go bad eventually you start to know backsliding in life that's what happens when your star is covered some of you you're watching me you might be a victim of this you are doing so good you're doing so well your business is flourishing then all of us had in bam then losses and losses accidents you know you know strange things begin to happen you know the devil went and covered the star of job if you read the, the book of job chapter 3 the third of it the devil went and covered the star of job everything began you know if it was bad news after bad news bad news of the badness disaster after disaster calamity after calamity if you found yourself you are doing well and then eventually things started to go bad for you know that your star has been covered that's a sign which your star has been covered star which are stolen when your star is stolen it might have been stolen when you were young so growing up you'll have no sense of destiny 
you will just be there you will not know and many people fall in the area of stolen stars and now this category of covered stars you have your destiny you have a star things are going so well you're good in business your career you're flourishing you're getting promotions after promotion then all of a sudden just you know you face rejection people don't like you people are not interested in you anymore You know, at some point, the star of Jesus was covered in the Bible. At some point, the star of Jesus, you know, when Jesus um, was made to, 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 you know, him and Barnabas to stand, and people were made to choose between Jesus and, and Barnabas, who should die? Who, whom did they choose? They chose Jesus to die. They wanted Jesus to die and, and, and Barnabas to go free. Imagine, those are the same people Jesus fed, the 5,000 people he fed. He, they saw him raising the dead. They saw him healing the sick. Those were the people, they, they were the same people who were singing Hosanna just a few days ago. Who wanted to make him king. But they were there to say that, crucify him, crucify him. What had happened? The star was covered. Once your star is covered, people reject you. The, the, the opinion, you know, the, you know, the good opinion that people had towards you, you know, the, you know it, 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 it turns to be negative. People are, they have a, they have you know a bad attitude towards you. They, they they just don't like you for no reason. Your star has been covered. It happened to our Lord Jesus. The star was covered. Everybody hated him. Say crucify him, crucify him, and he was crucified. But that happened for the glory of God. Now, if you want to know that your star, if you want to know that your star is uh is being used now. Most of these stars are being used by rich people. You know, it's, uh, for instance, you're working in a company, you know, and the moment you are employed in, in that company, you find the company begins, you know, to flourish. They are making profits. You may not know, you may think that it's your hard work, but not knowing that it is your star which is being used. Like the story of Joseph and Potiphar. Potiphar knew he was prospering because of Joseph. Uh, Laban knew he was prospering because of Jacob. So it's very important to know this. You, you can be working somewhere, but they are using a star. You are using your destiny. Yourself, you will not be progressing. Joseph was a slave. He wasn't benefiting from anything. He was just a mere slave. Lad. Jacob was just uh, like a servant to his uncle. But his uncle was benefiting. It's very bad. You are slaving. Not knowing that somebody is using your potential. Somebody is using your glory to grow their business, to grow their empire. And if you find yourself that you are employed and you and in that employment or the, the person you are working for is not paying you well and, um, and, and for one reason or another you can't resign from that job. Know that you have been, you know, they have arrested you so that you cannot leave. It's like we are enslaved. That's why I call it enslaved star. Your star has been enslaved. The same way Joseph was enslaved. He could not leave Potiphar's house. The moment he left Potiphar's house, he went to prison. La uh, Jacob could not leave Laban's house. He had to work even to get his two wives. So, if you find yourself that, you know, you are employed and, uh, you know, the, the company is making money and they're not paying you well. In most cases, my friend, that your star is one which is being used in that company. Most business, let me tell you something. Most business people, most, most CEO are very spiritual. You know, you may look them putting on suits, may just think they are smart, they are intellectuals. No, these people are highly spiritual. They know whom they employ. They know why they employ you. They don't just employ you. They know why they employ you. Before they employ you, they have a, they, they take your name to, your, to their altar to screen you spiritually, to know the kind of potential you carry, the kind of star you carry. If you are a star, you know, can, can, can profit their business. You need to be very careful when you go out, out there. So guys, this is how to tell it, whether your star is stolen, covered, or enslaved. See you in the next video.